Alright, what's good today with you guys? How's it going? So today, I'm going to talk about cerebral bulb palsy and club feet, how they both affect me. So, club feet is somewhat curable. You can get surgery on it, but it's not always guaranteed. So, I said, and if you do get surgery, you have to get it on each leg first, and that's two months recovery for each leg. Like, they break the bone. And then it heals up, but two months, like, being in bed and all that, not being able to do that much would suck. I mean, yeah, it might sound cool for some people. It doesn't sound cool for me. I mean, maybe, like, the old me, if I was, like, want to be lazy or something, but it's not even worth it. And I've had club feet since I was born. And I used to get laughed at and all that. That was, like, another thing. Or if I... I run. I'm not like the fastest runner, but I'll still run and compete with like people that are fast. Like I'll still run. Like I'm not going to give up on that. And cerebral palsy, it also affects the legs and all that and muscles. Like it affects my legs because I could be like swimming or just like watching TV or something and my leg or something will like lock up I mean like it'll like tighten up or something like out of nowhere it's like random I mean it hasn't happened to me in a couple of days or anything but I'm glad it has I'm thankful it hasn't because I hate when that stuff happens I mean some people say well it's not as bad as like other stuff I'm not I don't know, I'm trying to explain what I got and stuff. And just so you guys know, like, that's why I walk, like, my feet curve in when I walk. It's because of club feet. And I've, like, worn braces since I was little. And I know about all that stuff. And I'm 19 years old now, so just imagine, like, being laughed at for, like, the rest of your life and all that. But I really don't care. I used to care what people thought about all that, and then I didn't even care anymore, like, oh, oh, well, they, they just want to laugh at me and stuff, so, I'll do my own thing, and I'll be successful somewhere, rather it be YouTube or somewhere, but, I put that behind me, but, I mean, even if it does affect my ankles and, yeah, my ankles and stuff, I'll still go running all that or go on the long walk. Like, I really don't care. Like, that's something that won't stop me from, like, walking every day so I could go lose weight or go accomplish something. Because every day, you guys should try it, too. It's like, set a goal or accomplish something. Rather, be, like, something simple. Just be like, hey, I did this day. I actually feel good about it. And then that will actually help you out. But, like, I still help people out and all that, and I have, like, cerebral ball palsy on my... Like, I was born with it and stuff, so... Nothing I can really do about it. It's not curable. It's not even that bad for my case, but for, like, other people, it could be, like... Almost, like, life-threatening, almost, kind of, because... You're not able to, like, get up and all that, and you have to, like, sit down all day. But I'm thankful I'm able to walk and stuff and talk to a camera and talk to people. So that's what I'm thankful for as well. And being able to run still. Like, I really don't care what people think about it. But, like, cerebral palsy it basically messes with the muscle. So, yeah, like... If I said before, like a couple minutes ago, like some people are able to walk, some aren't. Like I'm glad my stuff isn't that bad. I'm, I like being able to go fishing. That's another thing I like doing is fishing and hanging out with friends. So thanks for understanding what it's like. I don't want people to feel bad for me. I just want people to like understand what I got because... There's some people that are worse than me. I really don't want people thinking, oh man, this guy's act like he has it bad and all that. I'm just saying, like, what I got and all that. Maybe you guys will understand. 
Maybe. Thanks for watching.